Hi, this is Walford Kaufman bringing you another devotion. Well, today I'm in the janitor's closet and I'm looking at all these items that we have here. Uh, we got items here and down here, across on the other side, on the cart. All these items that help take care of this church and our custodian does a great job. But uh, it's always kind of interesting that we have to, you've got two different kind of glass cleaners here two different kind of air fresheners, uh, a product over here that's a good product, but even on the back it says here that make sure you uh, use this in a little area to test it out first before you use it over the whole big area because it might cause a problem. Test it first. And then uh, there's this paint here. Well, look at that. It says here, 15 minute fast dry. I mean, it's right here on the label. But I know the other day I used it and 30 minutes later, it still wasn't dry. So what goes on, folks? I mean, I know on the back of these we have guarantees, but there's exceptions. It won't work on everything. We gotta have all these different products to get it done. But isn't it great when it comes to our Savior, our Lord, our God, we only need one. We only need one. We have that assurance. That's a godly uh, guarantee. And it's great to have that. In 2 Timothy 1, verse 12, Paul was writing. He's going through some troublesome times, like we're going through some troublesome times now, and all that happened to him. But look at this, what he says in verse 12. And that is why I am suffering as I am, yet I am not ashamed because I know whom I have believed and convinced that he is able to guard what I have entrusted to him for that day. I believe in some of our translations, it says, believe and am persuaded. And we are persuaded that He is able. He is able. He is that one and only God that we need. Isn't that great to know that we don't have to have many gods to do what we you know, get, get done in our life. We just need Him. So today, do you trust in that one God who is able, who is able, that assurance that we have? Trust in Him today. Let's pray. Father, I know many of these dear folks are going through some troublesome times. Let them be assured today that you're in control and that it will all work out in your perfect way. Lord, thank you for that. Bless each one in Jesus' name. Amen. Well, today, trust in the one who is able. 